A dog finds a drowning boy. He performs CPR on him. He listens to the boy's heart and finds no response. So the dog goes to a high platform, speeds up and jumps on the boy's heart. The boy wakes up. Bingo was a puppy in the circus. He's always been in charge of logistics. But one day the trainer pulls him onto the stage and makes him jump through a ring of fire. Seeing the fire reminded Bingo of his childhood memories. When he was a puppy, he was caught in a fire and both his owner and parents died in the accident. He has been a stray dog ever since. So the fire scared him and caused him to fail the show. An angry trainer with a gun drove him away. Once on the streets again, he met Chucky, a boy who was drowning. He rescued Chucky. After making sure he was still alive, Bingo gave him CPR and Chucky woke up. The lovely Bingo also dried Chucky's clothes. Chucky thanked Bingo so much that he decided to be his best friend for the rest of his life. But Chucky's father hates pets, so Chucky has to sneak him home. After staying with Chucky, Bingo learned to skateboard and play video games. The days went by happily, but soon Chucky had to move. The night before he left, Bingo went on a date with the dog next door, and he was drinking. When he woke up, Chucky's family had already left, and Bingo rushed after them. But since his father hated Bingo, he drove the car very fast. As he watched the car drive away, Bingo gave up the chase. He decides to use a scent trail to find Chucky. After a long walk, Bingo collapsed on the side of the road and was picked up by a man. Bingo realizes he's been taken to the kennel by the man who is the dog handler. The other dogs, aware of Bingo's arrival, take out their little mirrors to look at him. Bingo is quick to dig a hole, and after sneaking out, he lets the other dogs go. The dogs then work together to put the dog dealers in the car. Bingo drove the car into a wall to punish the dog dealers. After this, he said goodbye to his companions and set off again to find his owner. Following Chucky's scent, he arrives at a house just as the kidnappers are robbing it. The righteous Bingo calls the police and sends them a message in Morse code. Then he saved the family from being tied up, and the police arrived soon after. Without the hostages, the kidnappers threatened Bingo, but the police didn't care, they just opened fire. Luckily, Bingo was not hurt in the shootout. After this incident, Bingo became a hero and Chucky saw him on TV. Chucky sent a letter to the family's address, telling Bingo not to give up and that they would meet again. Receiving the letter, Bingo followed the scent and went on the road again. Hungry, he collapsed on a woman's doorstep. This time he met a kind person. The woman read the address on Bingo's letter. She bought him a ticket and kindly escorted him to the bus. She wished him luck in finding his owner. Bingo finally finds his owner, only to discover he has another dog. But Chucky was just walking a neighbor's dog. Heartbroken, Bingo leaves. Hungry Bingo goes to the garbage can to look for food. And when the chef arrives, he takes him to the back kitchen and gives him a job washing dishes. The two kidnappers who had been captured earlier escape from prison and post notices all over the street looking for Bingo. Chucky sees the posters and rushes over there, just in time to see the two kidnappers grabbing Bingo. Chucky tries his best to save Bingo. The kidnappers thought it would be more profitable to kidnap a child, so they kidnapped Chucky. Bingo didn't run away, but followed them and found out where Chucky was kidnapped. He knows that Chucky is still in love with him, so Bingo tries to save him. He runs to Chucky's house to ask his family for help, but they have no idea what Bingo means and tell him to get out of there. They didn't realize Chucky was in danger until the kidnappers called and said their son had been kidnapped. Bingo decided that the family couldn't help him, so he went to take on the kidnappers himself. But he was soon captured. The kidnappers leave a bomb behind to escape, and they run into the police before the bomb has a chance to go off. Although the bomb didn't explode, the cigarette butts they left behind caused a fire. Fearful of the flames, Bingo broke free from his bonds. Chucky tells him to pull the fire alarm, but Bingo is too scared to take that step. Just as he saw Chucky dying, he overcame his fear and pulled the fire alarm. The police and firefighters arrived and took Bingo and Chucky to the hospital. All of Bingo's friends who had seen him came to visit him, and father decided to keep Bingo in the face of high expectations. But he had one condition. Bingo had to be sterilized. The story ends here. The lovely Bingo finally has his own home. This is the end of this movie sharing. If you like it, you can subscribe to me. See you next time.